I think nowadays Broadway is really gauged for the tourist. And Broadway shows now are all about energy. People want to see shows with a great deal of energy, and they think they're getting their money's worth. And then there's outliers like Hamilton that come along that no one in their right mind would have produced except that it came from the public theater and it turns out to be a smash hit. And if you think of other shows like Avenue Q, which was a puppet show, sort of satire on Sesame Street and all, that came out of the blue. And some producers, like when Hairspray was a big hit, so these producers said, well, we'll do another John Waters movie, Cry Baby, and it was a big flop. Because the reason to do shows is not to emulate a previous hit. But I think now there's all these jukebox musicals going on. They're just, anybody who ever wrote a song seems to have a jukebox musical about their shows. And those are strictly for the tourists. But that's where the money is nowadays.